but yeah, I was definitely, I was ready. I was ready to go back. I, I just didn't know how mm. it was going to happen. Mm. So I remember distinctly, I, I graduated in 2018 and I was in, I was in the Netherlands in 2016. I graduated in 2018 and I'm like, okay, I want to go to Japan to do sports journalism, specifically baseball. Mm. And I was applying around there and just didn't land any of the jobs. It's a little harder when you don't speak Japanese. Right, sure. <laughs> and then I was applying. I applied to be a reporter in Rome, and that didn't work out. And funny enough, that was also, I think, because I wasn't good enough at Italian and Spanish. <laughs> sure. Um, <laughs> and then, you know, I was just trying to find something in journalism, but internationally, and getting kind of frustrated by those, by those results. So uh, I ended up staying for a lot little longer than i wanted to but that's when i ran into teaching english as a second language as an option 